From a public policy angle, it's, we need to think about electric vehicles like we think about gas stations in the sense of how does it work, what infrastructure we need. Uh, the simplistic part about it is, is A, we already have electricity pretty much everywhere, so we don't have to establish any of the other grid. grid. We don't have to bring it in fluid by a truck. We just have to set up that infrastructure. I've been driving for the last six months on my regular commute. I plug in here at work and like use it, it just for, for everyday stuff. I haven't had any problems with it whatsoever. 85 miles per gallon is my overall average. I started at the beginning in 2000 looking for something more reliable, looking for something green, looking for something that doesn't have the dependence on oil. This is chicken and egg for the consumer and it's chicken and egg for the manufacturer. The manufacturer does not want to uh, release or sell electric vehicles in a market that doesn't have infrastructure established. So being environmentally friendly doesn't have to mean it's bad for a company. It can help your bottom line. And that's actually what we found here at Mall of America. Well, you're here at the East Parking Ramp at Mall of America, and we're looking at electric car charging stations. We had some guests uh, contacting us saying, hey, we'd love to see this service at Mall of America. And so we followed their lead, and uh, we installed them about a year ago now. Yes, because it's so simple, I could easily see it catching on.